Hey guys, Dean here. Welcome to vlog 9. It is Thursday, May 7th. Hope you guys have had a great day so far. And uh, let's dive into it. So today, I have an interesting thought experiment that I would encourage you guys to try. Um, and I got a note here in front of me, so I'm going to kind of switch between looking at you guys and reading off um, my computer here where I pull up a note. So, uh, so here's the thought experiment. Imagine something that you want, really, really want, okay? And then imagine you receiving it instantly. Okay, so let's, uh, I'm going to walk through just a, probably a common want or this could be like, I think how it could go with, with other people, but I did this with myself and would be curious to see what the results are with other people. So imagine something that you want and you get it right away. Okay, so I think a lot of people probably want money. So fill in the blank on whatever number value that is on however much money you want and just imagine that you got it so i want two million dollars here you go sweet okay now i have two million dollars now what do you want so you just got two million dollars what's the next thing that you want after that and let's say you want either a bigger house or you want to start investing in real estate Okay, here you go. You got that. Now what do you want? And practice this seven times. And keep asking yourself, what do you want after you get the thing that you thought you wanted next in your mind? So if it's money, okay. House, okay. Whatever. Go down the list and imagine seven times and write it down or put it in your notes on your phone just like do bullet points and just be like okay what's the first thing that pops to mind that you want okay sweet now imagine you have that and go down the list seven times and my i'm curious to see what what the results are going to be for for each person my theory is that the seventh thing or more, you can just keep going. But the more down the road that you start thinking of what you really want, you might be able to actually get those things that are later down sooner because you've gotten the consumerism, materialistic, wants out of your head and pushed aside that aren't going to actually maybe bring you happiness maybe they will two million bucks would be pretty sweet um but the things that are down your list might actually be more attainable and something you can go out and get today i don't know if your results are going to be the same as mine. I went down mine and it was like, and these were just quick thoughts that came in and it was like money, real estate, boat, bike, like a really nice bike, even though I have a bike, um, a bike, nature, fire, people to share it with. That was my seventh thing. So it was like, okay, let's kind of like set myself up, get these things and then share them with people. But if I jump down to the seventh thing, I can just go have shared experiences with people now and I don't have to get anything. Um, I don't know, that's just a, an interesting little thought experiment that I'd be curious to see if others have a similar path or route and if you could build on this thought experiment and add other important things, I think that would be really neat. Um, I'm just about to launch uh, a podcast episode um, shortly. And 
the guest and I actually talked about how there's this one part in the episode where we talk about if you ask why something like five or seven times, then you'll get to the actual reason of why. So why you want to do something or, uh, yeah, ask, ask why seven times to yourself internally. Um, or if you're trying to figure out why you need to do something at work, maybe you need to ask like seven times or maybe not. I know I'm talking out loud here, but um, usually asking like, why do you want to do that? Oh, that's interesting. Why is that? Oh, okay. Oh, that's really interesting. Why is that? And you just like, you keep going and then you peel away the layers and you'll, you'll kind of get to like the nugget and the, the true source of whatever it is that needs to get done or you're searching for. It's usually hidden under a few layers. So anyways, that's, uh, that's my thought experiment to you guys. And, uh, if you haven't already, uh, click subscribe to my YouTube channel and you can also subscribe to my blog where I share these posts as well. Um, you can head on over to www.simpletounderstand.com and I'm also sharing these on LinkedIn and, uh, yeah. I think that's it. If, if you guys have any interesting topics, things that you'd like me to explore a little bit more, um, I'd be happy to do so. So feel free to leave a comment below and, uh, and let me know what, what topics you think would be interesting to explore and talk about uh, a little bit more at length. Um, I tried doing a Google search trend uh, or you can just do like Google search and then you can see what people search and what's trending. And then I thought, oh, maybe I'll do these videos on what's trending so that you can get a lot of views. But I just was not inspired by what people were searching. Um, like the 13th most popular search today on Google Trends is when is Mother's Day? It's like, okay, people, you should probably know that. Or just, I don't know, do you need to do a Google search? Like, it should just be, like, if you have a calendar on a smartphone, you should be able to just see it's marked. Why are you Googling that? You should just, you guys should just know, you know? You should just know. Um, and then Elon Musk and uh, his girlfriend Grimes just came up with a really interesting name for their new son that was born on May 4th. Um, and it is, let's see here, X. So it's like A-E-A-12 -A and how you pronounce it is A-A-12. Sorry, X, X-A-A-12. And, uh, yeah, that's, that's interesting. Um, you can listen to the Joe Rogan podcast where he just had Elon on it and I haven't listened to it yet, but, uh, definitely gonna give that one a listen. And, um, yeah, that's, that's what's trending right now. Twitter really blew up over that. That's cool. Not super inspired by um, by the Google Trends. NFL, a lot of NFL searches. Okay. Um, yeah. I don't know. That's it. I don't think I need to go into talking about what is is trending right right now. At least I don't know. It's not it's not that inspiring. And uh, I think I'm just going to wrap it up there, keep it short and sweet, do the thought experiment um, on your own, and uh, even actually put a little interesting twist on it. Ask uh, someone close to you what they think you want. 
and then say, oh, that's interesting. Okay, I got that. Now, what else do you think I want? And just like, see where that goes. Wonder if that would align with what your seven things are. Um, anyways, feel free to leave your results in the comment section below and hopefully find it helpful and just something insightful to spend five minutes doing or 10 minutes or however long it's gonna take. And uh, that's that. So thanks very much for listening. Um, and we'll see you guys tomorrow. Cheers.